Alright crew, get ready to work on your lockdown jiu-jitsu. So, I'm out here on side control, right? My partner is tight. If I keep my hand out here, my partner is gonna start working on arm bars, kimuras, right? And if I put my hand in front of him like a frame, he's gonna be able to go for his Americanas. So the safest place for my arm is to go over his head, in between his head and my head, and reaching over to his far armpit. Keeping my elbow tied behind his head so my partner doesn't posture up and walks around me as easy. Now I have his posture messed up a little. Now I'm gonna start gonna wiggle with my elbow until I get my elbow all the way through and I can make a grip with my hand right on the skirt of the gi. So I'm gonna keep on pushing with my frame. Right here is gonna be a little hard to get my knee through. That's why we push and pull with my partner creating reaction and I slide my knee all the way through until I get my elbow and knee to touch. If my elbow and knee are touching, it's gonna be a great frame. My partner cannot be able to pull, pass through that. Okay, so from here, I'm gonna push a little more with my forearm and my shin to create a little more space. And I start bringing my hands on his shoulder. One, two, to create a frame and hip skip with my foot that's on the mat. From right there, usually my partner wants to pull himself tighter, right, to don't lose that pass. So I'm gonna go with my hand on the shoulder, he's gonna let go. My other hand's gonna stay on the triceps. I'm gonna trap right there behind his elbow and I'm gonna bring my knees, one behind the shoulder and one in front of his other shoulder. Okay, so from that position, I'm gonna start pinching and turning out to the side to get his head closer to the mat. My partner does not like this, he wants to posture up. That's when I bring my knee to my chest, swing my foot over and lock my triangle to finish with our submission. Oops.